This is an empty realty presentation of this uh, house in the uh, Tivet Centre. So you're just, uh, just slightly elevated here, uh, directly above Porto Montenegro. Uh, let me zoom in. I've just got a wide angle uh, thing. Oh, I am zoomed in, <laughs> so you can't see that. So uh, uh, directly in front, you might be able to sort of uh, see the, the distinctive red and white crane tower, which is on Jesse One Porto Montenegro. Uh, but we're in a quiet uh, residential neighborhood here. We've got a nice villa here next door with a, a swimming pool. The owners are from Belgrade. They're only here a few times a year. So, so uh, very discreet, quiet uh, place. As I say, it's divided into three apartments. So this is uh, an investment uh, opportunity for somebody who's looking for uh, something to, to rent out uh, long or short uh, term rentals that work for, uh, for both styles. Uh, you've got this gated uh, area of the plot, which is uh, roughly 450 square meters, and the house is just short of 300 square meters. Uh, each apartment has its own uh, advantages. Let me just sort of uh, zoom out a little bit there. Uh, on this floor, obviously on the top floor with the, with the best views, you've got a very good sized uh, balcony here. But if I just go down a little bit, you can see that the floor below has a much bigger terrace as well which also wraps around uh, the house. And this is just the side of the house here where you can see these uh, citrus trees. So a decent sized plant, nice fig trees, mature palms uh, and everything. It was uh, very, very recently renovated and pretty much the, uh, the style of the, uh, each apartment is, uh, is pretty much identical. The top two apartments are two bedrooms with one bathroom. And then the ground floor, uh, which has a bigger terraced area, is one bedroom, one bathroom. So uh, all furnished, ready to, uh, to rent out or, or to, to live in. Uh, you could have this as a, as a villa if you wanted to have a, uh, just one big space for yourself. Uh, colors are nicely coordinated. Uh, it will kind of show well. Hopefully they have been promised some nice uh, pictures, so hopefully that will show you how well it presents. Uh, good sized living area here. Um, it's worthwhile asking about the furniture, probably, but not definitely, probably the furniture is included in the sale, so we can check on that. Uh, decent sized kitchen there. So I'll show you this apartment. I'm going to skip the middle apartment because there's somebody just uh, renting that out at the moment. And uh, then I'll go to the, the ground floor apartment. So this is the living area here. Uh, you have this nice, uh, unusual stone uh, floor here. This and the other apartments here. You just have this little sort of terrace area here to the side. So let me just show you the bedrooms and bathrooms. So you have the bathroom in the middle, and then you have this bedroom here with uh, the two singles, but obviously big enough for a uh, for, uh, double bed, and the wardrobe's there. And I like this bathroom. It's got a very nice, unusual feature, so uh, oh, it's not me in the mirror. Uh, double sink here. And when they've renovated, this was the old staircase, and they've actually used this space very ingeniously for the shower. So you have a nice and usual shower place there. And let me just show you the bedroom. So the, uh, the finishes are nice. You've got this nice uh, uh, wooden doors here. And this one obviously is as a double room. So here we are, that's that. I'll uh, walk down the stairs and I'll walk down to the ground floor. As I said, the, uh, the middle floor is actually being uh, used at the moment. Uh, so it's been rented out. But you get an idea. So this is welcome to the neighborhood. This is the neighborhood here. And uh, excuse me, beep beep. And uh, so this is the middle floor. Whoops, we've just got the owner there and his friend. And then We'll just go to the parking area here. So parking for four cars, as I said. You actually have two separate uh, gated entrances here. So uh, you can actually sort of uh, open this gate here and park here, as this person has done here. And then another gate there to park on the other side. So we'll just walk through. Uh, and let's say you've got this kind of bigger sort of uh, terraced area here, which is shaded from the balcony above. Again, you have this, uh, this stone floor here and nice open plan space so you can see uh, how wide and open it is there so uh, again uh, tastefully thought about when they are uh, doing the picking the furniture and the colors 
and this one as I said is one bedroom and one bathroom so let me show you the bathroom so there we are like most places in Montenegro you have the washing machine and the boiler there nice corner shower good size yeah this is probably about a meter in uh, diameter for the corner shower or radius however you describe it I'm not sure and there's the bedroom and uh, in this bedroom here you have the lights to the side and the door straight out onto the terrace air conditioning of course uh, there's also some storage here as well and let me just take you back through and this sorry I just wanted to show you this area here so we've got this kind of wide open space here uh, which is going to be suitable to put more wardrobes or dressing tables or even you can put an office in there if you like so let me take you to the front so say past these great palm trees fig trees uh, and I'll show you the house itself you've got these uh, wrought iron gates here like I said and this is the house here so let's see if we can get a better view but anyway you can see it's uh, nicely framed with these uh, flowering trees <laughs> which I knew what they were called and that's it so we're in Tivat uh, we've got a great place which would be good for an investment to rent out somewhere to stay yourself and to uh, to rent out uh, it's very handy actually having three apartments together because uh, some people are looking for villa holidays there are actually maybe two families and they want to sort of uh, be together but have their own uh, separate living accommodation as well so there we are i'm peter at ntrealty.me and if you have any questions you can call me plus 382 67 268 805 and thank you for watching